Welcome to our Excel training. In Microsoft Excel, you can use different methods to divide our data into groups of two and get subtotals. One of them is if you have a short list like this, you can add a subtotal to every two lines, create a blank line like this, create the gaps like this, and then group them like this to get the group totals. In fact, different methods can be applied to get the totals here faster. After selecting here like this, I'm pressing and holding control again and selecting the spaces like this. After selecting these, let's select them again like this. After selecting them correctly, when you press the total icon, the subtotals will be taken from here as follows when you press. Of course, when the list here is a short list, it is easy to do these but let's duplicate the same list like this. Let's copy it and paste it under it again and paste it again. When the data here increases, we need to apply a simpler method to collect them in groups of two and three and perform operations. For this, for example, if we are going to divide it into groups of two, we write one here and one under it again, and after making the line under one equal, we add the first value plus one. Then it is equal again. This time we add plus one to the second value, and when you hold the last two values and pull them down, look at them as they are. The numbers automatically multiply by twos. We had 15 data. There were 30 data that went up to 15. Now we come here. We write one. And by pressing the control button on the keyboard, we pull it back up to 15 so that we can perform operations to create a third space. Like this. Then what you need to do is to click the right button on the number and sort it from smallest to largest to ensure that these spaces are created automatically. Then we can delete this. Now after deleting here to get the totals, be careful about the spaces here. These spaces will spoil the work. So you need to select them from here by pressing control carefully. If these spaces will cause problems, let's apply a method like this from the beginning. Look. Let's keep the spaces with spaces like this. While you're here, select the table like this. After selecting here, find and select go to special blanks. After saying OK, type 0 from the keyboard, press Control, hold it down, press Enter. Fill all empty cells with zeros. Then when you click the right button and sort from smallest to largest while these numbers are here again, the gaps will appear again. Let's delete this. Then, after selecting the entire table in our table correctly, widen it like this. Find and select again. Go to Special. After saying OK for the spaces, when you press the total, we see that the subtotals are taken directly. It is a very enjoyable process. From here, we can do operations such as coloring the formulas in this way. Similarly, let's select the spaces here. Likewise, we select the spaces again from here. And let's write the total here. You'll see. In this way, friends, you can easily get the totals in large lists in groups of twos, twos, threes, threes. If you had to make this a group of three, what you would have to do is look at the expression here again. Let's delete these from here again. I deleted it as including the spaces. We'll come here, we'll write one. We'll write three ones. Then we'll say equals and make the top value plus one. Then we'll say equals again and make the middle value plus one. We'll say equals again and make the bottom value plus one. Then we will select these two expressions below and pull it down. What is the last number it ends with? Look, 10. Now we will generate numbers from 1 to 10 under this again. Let's do it with a different method. Write 1, 2. Bring this up to 10 like this. Then write button sort again. When you sort from largest to smallest, the data will open like this. I sorted from smallest to largest. Delete this place. Let's select the table correctly. Don't forget to select a space from the bottom here, find the spaces, count down the operations. 
when you press the total, the totals will be taken automatically and you can bold them and do different operations.